Well, hello, fellow collectors, guys and girls from around the world. It's the Commander 35 back here again, and I hope y'all doing well today. Coming at you here with another Star Wars collectibles related news video. And this time around, we have some more Black Series 6 inch reveals from NYCC. And I already did a video sort of talking about some figures already, but this time we got a bunch more that I did not expect to see. But like I said, I'd be on top of it right away if we got any more images, and here we go. And the first one we're going to look at real quick here is Asti, the X-Wing alien pilot. As you can see, his helmet is off this time, giving you a better look at him. Um, definitely a unique design for a creature. He's also got a blaster there, and um, yeah... Uh, he still looks very cool, and uh, I'm glad that the helmet is removable in the first place, because usually, uh, sometimes, you know, they wouldn't give you that option on some figures from Hasbro, you know that. Next up, a more clear image of General Hux from the First Order, of course, and um, not much has changed, he still looks like a Nazi. Moving along, we have the Resistance Trooper, now finally in 6-inch scale, um, looking beautiful. He's got his huge-ass uh, blaster rifle there. And his helmet especially is pretty darn cool. That green visor he's rocking and uh, these straps going over. I'm assuming ammunition inside there and his, his um, jacket looks very cool as well. The tan and all that, his boots. Very like um, like a resistance person would be. Like uh, that, that kind of dress code. Um, and um, I'm digging it. I'm, I, I really am excited to see hopefully huge uh, battles with the stormtroopers and... You know, just rebel troopers. I just want to see more um, crazy action with that. Hopefully, we'll get it. Real quick, we got a side image of Captain Phasma herself, and she's already sort of been out in the in the most current new wave of the Black Series stuff. But uh, I guess they're re-releasing her with this as well, and still the figure looks great. Um, I I really want a six-inch Black Series version as opposed to the uh, three and three-quarter inch one I have from the standard Force Awakens line, which is, it's, I have to say, it's terrible, especially compared to seeing something like this. But um, the only downside to it so far that I can see is that on all these figures, they're giving her a, a solid plastic cape when they should be giving soft goods. Um, uh, disappointed with that only. Here we have the First Order Snowtrooper, uh, just a standard um, army builder figure right here, uh, banging, um, loving it. And uh, especially, I'm, I cannot get over how much I enjoy that they're using the uh, Arabish language so much more in all of the, like, just everywhere. On the armors of all the characters now and stuff. Um, and you can see right, it's on his chest right there, so that's uh, fantastic. And um, his blaster, and I just, I like the design of the new S Snow Trooper. I've, I've always been a fan of it since it was released, to be honest. I even liked it more than the First Order S Stormtrooper helmet. And, um, well, the figure looks great. Um, six inch, you can clearly, he has, it looks, uh, I'm not sure, uh, if it's soft goods or if it's just solid plastic on his, on his skirt. It's hard to tell. I'm going to say probably solid plastic. But, um, the figure still looks great. And I know they have the, um, officer version up on Toys R Us, so if you want that one, you can go check it out. Maybe it's still available, I'm not sure. But I'd probably go for this one first, so what's the point of having an officer if you have no grunts to go along with him? And finally, we have the First Order TIE Fighter Pilot. Oh my god, this is one badass looking figure. Can't you tell already? Um, yes, okay. So, well, he's got a blaster. He's got this... Uh, I love the First Order symbol. It's on his shoulder right there, as you can see. Um... Uh, menacing menacing and the, the glossy black plastic on certain sections it just comes together so sexy especially on this helmet man oh man I just and in case you didn't know there is actually a, a battle pack type thing with the TIE fighter six inch scale with a six inch TIE fighter pilot first order and it's actually a variation that one's actually a special forces um, pilot because he has like the, the red streaks going down his helmet whereas this one is just a standard pilot it seems so that's cool that we're getting variations you know obviously this will be the much more um, logical choice for you to go for to pick up because it's much cheaper than getting the whole tie fighter for like a hundred and something dollars but anyway guys um thank you all so much for watching please give this video a like if you enjoyed share it if you can and subscribe for more star wars collectibles related news this has been me the command 35 until next time keep the peace and love going and may the force be with you Bye bye